Yo, Navatos, we are out here on the Sportster fine tuning the clutch. Just installed it, as you guys can see. I already installed this, uh, what is this called? Uh, drag specialties. Because I'm not going to get into the full details, but uh, the perch of your lever is actually the holder for your signal light, as you can see right here. It's not like on your Milwaukee 8, it's not the same. Should I turn off the bike? Um, I don't know. I, I I believe you guys can hear me. So we are waiting on parts. This isn't the final form because I mean it looks a little dumb. I don't like the way it looks. And oh wow, I just noticed I have two LEDs gone out. No, three. Three LEDs have gone out on my on my right side. So this is from Amazon. Uh, I don't know when those went out. I don't know. I, uh, I'm not too sure, but. Uh, uh anyways where was i i wonder if any of these have gone out so um yeah where was it oh yeah we are fine tuning my clutch i already installed it it was a little tight earlier so i'm i'm adjusting it like i said um this just depends on you guys it all depends on on how you want your clutch to feel you could leave it at the uh at the 1 8 mark, if you guys saw my, the install part of the video, I, I don't know if I'm going to put that in here. But uh, I like to kind of feel it out. So I'm not sure if you guys can see. This is when the friction zone starts to engage. So right about there. That's when it starts going. And that that might be a little bit too tight. So when, when your clutch is tight, your friction zone is out, it's more out here. So you could have your friction if, if your bike if your friction zone is uh is all the way out here, that means you're it's way too tight. All right, if you have your friction zone and it's right up out here, it's tight. Uh, I mean, depending on how you like your bike, maybe I mean maybe your hand, it, um, I, maybe you have limitations. Maybe there's just something wrong and you want that friction zone. You don't like engaging your your lever all the way in then i guess you could have it that way but from for my taste having the friction zone out here is way too tight you could burn out your clutch you could do some damage so it's actually better for you to have a loose clutch than a tight clutch because if it's way too tight your bike's gonna feel donkey-ish it's not gonna have the the power because because the, the 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 clutch is never disengaging so you will know all right if you were to do your levers and you're getting on it maybe about 3000 rpm 4000 rpm and it just doesn't take off that's because your clutch is too tight so you guys saw right about here i'm just gonna loosen it up a little bit more so we're gonna move this up a tad bit not a lot just a little bit and then we're gonna get back on it and we're gonna feel it out there should be a little bit sooner as you guys can see now it's maybe it's still not enough let me move it up a little bit more all right now it's about so you guys want to see right here well, i'm going to show you guys i don't know if you guys can see it but now it's engaging right about this spot right here i think i like this instead i like it a little bit loose i like having it closer to my grip yes i have to fully engage it but like I said, I'm okay with that. So if you're out there and you're having some issues, like uh, like 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 uh, like right now, you, you kind of see how it's engaging the friction zone, and you have your, your 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 lever fully engaged like this, and it's still creeping. That means your clutch is way too loose. So if you're just out there and you're wondering and you're new to this, I, I know a lot of you guys are um, are are new to this. Um, then you know that's that's what that is. So. Once again, if friction zone is all the way over here, you're fully engaged, it's loose. If your friction zone is out here, towards uh, towards the end of your of your lever, out here, I mean like towards my handguard, your your uh, your clutch is, is a little too tight. So I think I like this very much. I'd say it's about 20% uh, release of the lever. That's when it starts taking off. So let's just take it out for a spin see how we light that so looks pretty good feels pretty good um, you know just 
trying to find that sweet spot for this new uh, this new one finger clutch. <laughs> yeah, so I mean that's that's just pretty much what you do. You just ride around, try to you know find the sweet spot, try to you know see how it feels if you like it you can keep adjusting it you can keep on messing with it like i said you collapse the uh the clutch cable uh which loosens it gives your friction zone a little bit towards your grip if you extend the uh, clutch line then you are tightening the clutch so um it, your friction zone is going to be towards my uh, hand guard it's going to be a little bit out more so that's pretty much it you guys just you know leave a comment down below like the video if you guys you know found the the video useful uh, i'm gonna keep on riding uh you know just gonna keep on trying it out maybe I'll, I'll probably adjust it a little bit more but yeah i mean that's pretty much it it's pretty easy guys all right stay out there stay safe don't believe everything you read life's a risk get out there and ride later